Um, I thought I would uh, speak tonight about uh, Obama's, President Obama's second year uh, in foreign policy. Um, that's because the first year wasn't, there wasn't a lot to speak about, or a lot good to speak about, as you'll see. Um, but I have good uh, reason to feel that the second year is um, shaping up to be a lot better. Uh, when President Obama uh, was uh, sworn in and gave his inaugural speech as the first African-American uh, president uh, to be elected in the United States, he made very clear that engaging the world would be one of his highest priorities. It was meant to be a very, a very different kind of engagement from that of his predecessor, George W. Bush. There would be a withdrawal of troops from Iraq, an outstretched uh, hand to Iran, a reset in the relationship with Russia, a new economic partnership with China, and a commitment to pursue peace in the Middle East from uh, the very first uh, day in office. In reality, the first year, um, as I think you're aware, turned out to be an extremely difficult one for the president. The uh, effort to engage with Iran uh, fell victim to uh, developments there, um, in particular the uh, stealing of the elections by uh, Ahmadinejad and the regime uh, and the suppression of uh, dissent in a very brutal way uh, changed the whole dynamic uh, within Iran and uh, in terms of the potential for Iran's interaction with the United States. 